Hey, what's going on guys? Super Mac guy here back at it again with another Nintendo Switch video. Been cranking out a lot of videos recently. Um, yeah, I, I kind of like doing this. Um, guys, if you haven't seen my previous Nintendo Switch videos, I recommend that you do. I'll leave a link in the description below down for my last Nintendo Switch video where I talked about accessories. And I'll leave another link below down for the original Switch video that I uploaded about my reaction to the whole stream. But um, today we're going to talk about a game that should be free and packed in with the Nintendo Switch. And that's 1-2 Switch. That's one of the first games they announced for the Nintendo Switch. When they announced it, I seriously thought it was going to be a pack-in title. I did not know you had to pay 50 bucks for it. Um, it. Yeah, it is going to cost you 50 bucks. I will put up a screenshot I found on Amazon that um, has it off for pre-order right now. It's $49.99, but as usual, the tax is going to end up at $50. So yeah, 1-2 Switch for $50. Hell no, never. I'm never going to waste $50 on 1-2 Switch. I don't know who would. So let's get a rundown of the games that 1-2 Switch comes with. The mini games. It's basically a game with mini games. So yeah. Um, it reminds me a lot of the Wii Sports era of the Nintendo, you know, saga. They have Samurai Training, which I saw a gameplay video of on IGN. Samurai Training basically is one of you is trying to catch the sword, I think, from what I can tell from the gameplay. The other guy is the Samurai, and he uh, swings down the Joy-Con down, and you try to catch it with the other Joy-Con. Looks okay, I guess. Ball count, they, I think the main issue, I mean, not the main issue, the main point of ball count is to um, showcase the HD rumble that the Joy-Cons have. The synopsis of the of the mini game is you have to figure out how many balls are in the little wooden box by tilting around the Joy-Con and the HD rumble will like um, try to copy the way like a ball would feel in a box. That's all ball count really is. And you have to guess how much balls are in there. Whoever guess is the closest amount wins, I guess. Copy Dance is also for the 1-2 Switch game. Basically, you strike a pose and your friend tries to copy it. Pretty simple. That's what I could see. Milk is pretty funny. <laughs> um, you have to milk a cow. and Well, the gesture you have to do is really... Um, well, it's a really interesting gesture that you have to do, milk. Uh, that looks like fun. So, but yeah, basically milk a cow. Whoever milks the most milk out of the cow wins, I guess. Quick draw, ah, oh, quick draw. The Clint, the Clint Eastwood Red Dead Redemption uh, <laughs> video we got for the introduction of Quick Draw really screwed with my mind. So like, uh, it's like a cowboy game basically. Um, you draw on each other and shoot each other with the Joy Cons. That's all there is to it. Then Safe Crack is another game. I think it's the last game. I don't know if there's any more mini games on One Two Switch, but I think these are all the games that are, have been announced. Emery Training, Ball Count, Copy Dance, Milk, Quick Draw, and Safe Crack. Safe Crack. It sounds exactly what it is. It's exactly what the name says. Safe crack. You got to crack a safe with the joy cons and stuff. So you're probably wondering, well, okay, so you get um, samurai training one, ball count two, three, copy dance, four, milk, five, quick draw, and you get a uh, safe crack, which is, um, yeah, I mean, it's safe crack. <laughs> the sixth game of the, of the one, two switch, um, party game. Um, Listen, I don't know what the hell Nintendo has been smoking, but that game is not worth $50. The most amount of money I would pay for that game is around $20. That's as much I'd pay for that game. Even $29.99 might be acceptable, but even then, that's just stressing it out. No way in hell this is going to push any units. This is not a system seller for the Wii U. I mean, not the Wii U, for the Nintendo Switch. I already see memes coming out out of this. I already see people referring to as 1-2 Switch as the laughing stock right now of the whole Nintendo Switch um, announcement stream, live stream that they had. It's 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 a laughing stock right now, basically. System seller, another um, big YouTuber, SpawnWave, was making a really funny video about 1-2 Switch, how it's a system seller. He called GameStop, asking, Gil, man, do you have any 1-2 uh, Switches I can pre-order? That was pretty funny. Yeah, it, it's not worth 50 bucks. It's just a bunch of mini games for mini party games that I've probably seen on like on shovelware for the Nintendo Wii, albeit probably shittier though. I don't think it's worth it. The animations of the game are pretty simple. These aren't groundbreaking graphics, mind you. These aren't Unreal Engine 4 graphics or Zelda Breath of the Wild um, gameplay mechanics here. There is no story to these games. At least I don't think there is not what I can tell from. No story, no cutting edge graph cutting edge graphics if you're a graphics whore then yeah this game's not for you 
the gameplay seems pretty simple, so I guess that's a positive. A lot of people will be able to pick this up and do it quick. Not a lot of content for 50 bucks, if you ask me. This definitely is going to end up on GameStop's used game shelf for like 10 bucks eventually. It just seems really... Um, it There's just not a whole lot of game in there. That, uh, that's the best way I can put it. There's not a whole lot of game in there. With Zelda Breath of the Wild, you're going to have a huge adventure, lots of items, weapons, a great story, by the way. That's guaranteed with almost every Zelda game. A great story, um, memorable characters and stuff. G great moments that stay with you for the rest of your life. Once you switch, well, it's a party game, I guess. That's going to be semi-popular with party-going people. It, it's just, there's not enough content in the game. I don't know, maybe add six more mini-games, I guess. But even then... It's just a bunch of mini games. This really should be bundled in with the Switch as a preloaded game on the Switch unit. But then again, that would be an issue since the Switch only has 32 gigabytes of onboard memory. And if you already pre-download um, one to Switch onto all Switches, then you're going to have a lower memory count. And don't forget that the OS takes part of the memory also. So yeah, who knows? That 32 gigabyte might be closer to like 25 or 26. Who knows? And then you're going to have to buy another SD card, even though you really shouldn't, since consoles should come with enough memory from the start. That's another thing I've been pissed off about from Nintendo, them refusing to give us more memory. But you could always upgrade via a mini SD card, but that's just a pain in the ass. It should already come ready to go from the box. You shouldn't have to buy more memory. Sony does it, Xbox doesn't, why can't Nintendo do it, you know? Or they could um, give a physical copy of the game with the Nintendo Switch, which I think would be the better route. So that way the game doesn't take up any space or as much space if it were a digital download onto the Nintendo Switch. But yeah, guys, like I said, I don't think it's worth it. For the six games you're getting, Samurai Training, Ball Count, Copy Dance Milk, Quick Draw, Save Crack, for 50 bucks. Honestly, look, if I were to give you the option of buying... Now, mind you, I know this game is more expensive, but listen to me. Would you rather buy 1-2 Switch or The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild? Well... Honestly, of course, Breath of the Wild, there's no point where you shouldn't be buying Breath of the Wild over 1-2 Switch. Not enough content in the game for me, personally. It looks bland. The animations aren't even that crazy. I, I feel like Nintendo kind of phoned it in with 1-2 Switch. I'm guessing this is more show made more more to showcase the joy cons and stuff you know the the newest features and stuff but honestly i don't see many people buying one to switch as a launch title it's it's a launch title i guarantee you when this thing launches go to your local target go to your local walmart go to your local best buy and i guarantee you one to switch will be perfectly in stock so yeah anyways guys what do you guys think about one two switch do you think it's worth 50 bucks will you be picking it up for 50 bucks do you think it should be an included game for the nintendo switch already with the switch bundle like a like a switch bundle or like it should come standard with the switch let me know in the comments down below uh guys if you uh um aren't subscribed yet if you like the channel why not subscribe oh and for my subscribers already don't forget to hit that notification bell it tells you automatically when i upload and i do plan to be uploading more videos that are related to the nintendo switch during this whole week so yeah click the notification bell guys it'll keep you up to see everything um like if you like it dislike if you dislike it tell me why favorite it who knows share it that'll help me too anyways guys super mech guy take it easy